Hey, what's up everyone? This is Tony with GameZone.com and today we're going to be going over the Aliens Colonial Marines multiplayer. Now we've got a couple different multiplayer modes. We got Team Deathmatch, Extermination, Escape, and Survivor. And no FPS multiplayer game is complete without being able to edit your loadouts and edit your appearance. Now first thing we're going to check out is Team Deathmatch. Here we're going to start out as a Space Marine. Now this was my first time playing the game. Found it really intuitive. The controls are uh, pretty simple to get a hold of. I pulled out the scanner and got a really great uh, Aliens moment where uh, I saw some red dots come up and I'm looking around. Got a couple red dots here. Okay. All right. Where are they coming from? Look down the hallway. They're not there. Oh man, this is it, man. Game over, man. <laughs> so then an alien drops down like a nightmare. Starts swinging at him. Toss a grenade, slash, elbow him in the face, he dies. Then I get my face melted off. Awesome! Very cool. A lot of fun. Next, got a couple Marines around me. This guy decides to throw a grenade at me. I'm confused. I think there's an alien behind me, but I'm going to try and take this one out with my grenade. Nope, I missed him. He's hitting me with his juice. Got this other one coming around. Ripped my arm off. Really good to stay with your team. Really good to check all angles. Definitely gives you that uh, Space Marines stuck on a ship with aliens feeling. So, uh, very good. This is uh, Extermination Mode as a Xenomorph. Now, I got the tail flicking uh, in the camera, which I don't like that at all. I, don't, I think that's terrible. But uh, this was a pretty sweet kill. Jump up, take this guy out. He was a one-man army, turned him into a one-armed manny. Alright, I'm sorry about that. So now, as a spitter, you get a little bit of a different uh, tactic here. You can hit at range, you can charge it up, uh, you can uh, arc it. So it's a very complicated uh, move, but very devastating if you can hit it at long range. Uh, here, just swiping at this guy. He uh, catches me on fire. You definitely want to get out of the flames. Uh, flames are deadly in this game. Uh, you can always see the enemies through walls, which is great when you're a xenomorph. As the, uh, as the humans, as a space marine, you, uh, you have to uh, arm the bombs and blow up the eggs, uh, and uh, then the aliens are trying to attack you. So it's really exciting, really fast-paced. As you can see, all, all hell breaks loose. There's some kind of lightning grenade. Uh, really interesting. Decided to pull out the pistol, like the pistol in some other uh, FPS games. Uh, didn't go so well. This guy's coming at me. Figured I'd try and take him out with a pistol, but definitely good to stay with your team. You don't want to go one-on-one -on -one with these guys. Uh, they will rip you apart. Uh, the assault rifle, as you can see, at range, very good, good sights, not a lot of kickback. Uh, I was able to track and kill that alien pretty good. Here, you get to level up your Xenomorph progress and your Marine progress separately. So when you play the multiplayer, the more you play as a Xenomorph, the more you'll get more unlocks for that. And the more you play as a uh, uh, soldier, you get more unlocks for that. Now, as you play the game, you get points. You can spend those points on upgrades for your weapons either on the Xenomorph side or the Marine side. Uh, here you can see where I'm spending a point on getting uh, different uh, attachments for my guns. There's a couple different shotguns, double different... What What do you need a silencer for in space? Uh, uh, I don't know. Now we're going to check out Escape. Escape is really cool. It's a bunch of Marines trying to escape. This is a really epic moment where, you know, the ship's coming down and they're just all huddled up and they're just shooting at aliens. They're just rushing them. It's a really awesome feeling. It was a really great moment. Um, derp through the whole thing, as you can see, just failing miserably at killing any Marine. But as a Marine, defending my position, waiting for the elevator, boom, dead. Very gratifying. So you've got that. You've got Survivor. Now, this is really interesting. The Xenomorphs can climb on the walls, the ceilings. You can really climb on anything. And uh, it really adds to that element of fear and uh, being able to just be a real creeper and just climb on anything and just be a monster. And you don't want them to see you climb on those walls because it's just as easy for them to kill you up there. But it's a better way to hide. It, it adds an entirely different element to the game and it really uh, makes it uh, really interesting and fun to be the, uh, to be the monster. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Tune in to more at GameZone.com.